Will Wolf, will Wolf, will the Wolf be ready for the Arnolds? Well, he will definitely be ready. It will be a brand new experience for the Wolf. It's coming back from a long injury. You guys have to understand one thing. Coming back from a severe injury that he had with uh, a big surgery, like a spinal fusion surgery, when they go through your neck fix your spinal cord. Uh, they fuse that thing together with, I think, three, four, or five, or six screws. Who knows how many screws in a plate? It's not easy to come back from that. First of all, it's not easy losing a lot of weight and then coming back, training the way you used to train, especially when you know you had surgery done. So everything is going to be a little harder for the big bad wolf, but he has the motivation, he has the drive, and he has the support from his close people that are there supporting him, you know what I mean? Because in a face, when you almost two years and you can't do what you love to do and what you uh, were born to do, and he was one of the best for many, many years. So you have to understand it's, it's a lot of pressure on the wolf right now, you know? And it's not easy to just look past all the negative comments that he gets. You know what I mean? You can't, you, you got to focus on the positive, but there's a lot of negative comments. For people that are just negative, people that just like to hate, or people that just, you know, they want to voice their opinion, which is perfectly fine. That's why we have the social media, internet, where people can say what they want to say. But at the end of the day, for him, it's his main focus is just to get on that stage, to present a good package, and, and, and not to disappoint. This is his main focus right now. Of course, he trains, he trains to, you know, you know he, all these guys on that stage, he's been beaten for years. So, but these guys were not sleeping the, the past two years when Dennis wasn't competing. So, you know, a lot of them probably caught up. And Dennis is might not be the same size as he used to be when it comes to being the biggest on stage. So uh, that might not be the case. But uh, I don't think that's, that's the goal right now. The goal right now is to get on that stage to uh, perform in front of his supporters, his fans, and let the people know that there's no obstacle that you can't overcome. Okay? There's every, you know, anything's possible if you put your heart and your mind to it. And at the end of the day, it's already a success if he makes it on that stage and he gets in front of the crowd, in front of his fans that looking, you know, been looking forward to seeing him back on stage. And he gets to pose and he gets to do what he loves to do. End of story. That's all I can say to that. Whatever happens, I don't know. Dennis won't know. Nobody knows until we get, you know, we get to that, get to prejudging guys go on stage. That's when we can make some fair assessments and see where he will play, so where he, you know, will end up. Ich äh, bin zwar nicht so schwer wie normalerweise in der Vorbereitung. Ja, mir fehlen etwa seit, für die Zeit sieben Wochen vorher etwa fünf Kilo, aber dafür ist die Form großartig. Ja. Wie war es denn überhaupt jetzt? Oder, oder ähm, kann man jetzt schon sagen? Weil wir haben es ja gesehen, die Form ist schon sehr gut. Läuft jetzt quasi schon die Diät und die in die richtige Vorbereitung, die heiße Phase für die Arnolds oder ist aktuell wirklich noch eher so? Äh, Dennis hat ja wirklich gesagt, also Dennis James, bei dem wir ja auch, auch war, hat gesagt, du sollst essen, essen, essen. Erstmal theoretisch wärst du ja, oder könnte man ja fast in zwei Wochen, drei Wochen fertig sein, wenn du jetzt ein bisschen die Schrauben anziehen würdest. Ja, okay, ja, das stimmt, was er gesagt hat und äh, man sieht auch in einer Form, dass... Äh, okay, das ist natürlich eine Einstellungs-, äh, oder eine Einstellungssache gewesen für mich. Äh, man muss erstmal sich äh, ja, darauf einstellen, dass äh, was man plant oder vorhat, auch äh, 100% durchzugehen zu können. Und äh, ja, wie gesagt, nach der OP waren natürlich äh, nie so schöne Zeiten, habe viele Sachen äh, ja, durchmachen müssen, mental und äh, körperlich, äh, weil ich meine, die äh, Recovery-Zeit äh, kann man oder, oder hat man mir nicht äh, ja, voraus sein können. Man sagt immer, okay, äh, du bist wieder in Ordnung, aber du bist halt Spitzensportler, da wird...